Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this video, we are going to solve this quartic equation from algebra and we will find out the real and complex solutions using algebraic identities, algebraic manipulation. So let's get started. I will consider the first bracket and the last bracket altogether. So I will write in this manner x plus 1 times x plus 4 times x plus 2 times x plus 3 minus 8 equal to 0. Now let's take the product of first two and let's take the product of last two brackets or parenthesis. So I will write x square plus 4x plus x 5x plus 4 here I will be getting x square 3x plus 2x 5x plus 6 minus 8 equal to 0. Now from this point we are having two paths, two ways available. First one is either we can consider x square plus 5x equal to t and then we can frame t plus 4, t plus 6 minus 8 equal to 0. We will open the bracket make the equation in quadratic form, we will solve that equation. Second way, let us consider x square plus 5x plus 4 equal to t. So, it will become t, t plus 2 minus 8 equal to 0. Again quadratic will form, we will solve for quadratic. But this video, we will see the third approach. I am writing this 4 as 5 minus 1 and then 6 as 5 plus 1. See after that what will happen. It will form x square plus 5x plus 5 minus 1 and second bracket would be x square plus 5x plus 5 plus 1 minus 8 equal to 0. Now I will consider this term as a because in my mind it is a b a b so you can see second parenthesis is a plus b first parenthesis will give us a minus b so difference of a square formula difference of a square formula will come into the picture that is a minus b times a plus b can be written as a square minus b square. So I will write the same. I will consider a square minus b square. So what is a? x square plus 5x plus 5 whole square minus b is 1. So it is 1 square. Up to this point it is ok and this term is as it is 8 equal to 0. Now let us open this bracket rectangular bracket square bracket. So I will write x square plus 5x plus 5 whole square. Now this is minus 1 minus 8 equal to 0. Again I will write x square plus 5x plus 5 whole square minus 9 it is. Let me write one last time and then I will write x square plus 5x plus 5 whole square and 9 is 3 square. So what I am going to do? I will consider this one as A and this one again as B. Now you can see A square minus B square. Again I will write A minus B, A plus B. So let me write, I will write, let me write here x square plus 5x plus 5 plus 3. This is a plus b. 
and again I will write x square plus 5x plus 5 minus 3. A minus B is done. A square minus B square, A plus B. So plus 3 in first bracket and minus 3 in second bracket because of A plus B, A minus B. So overall what will we will get actually x square plus 5x plus 8 in first bracket and x square plus 5x plus 2 in second bracket equal to 0. Okay. So let's solve x square plus 5x plus 8, x square plus 5x plus 2. So if I will write here, let me write x square plus 5x plus 8 times x square plus 5x plus 2 equal to 0. Now we will solve both of the quadratic equations for our quartic solution. So I am putting x square plus 5x plus 8 equal to 0 here and I am writing x square plus 5x plus 2 equal to 0 here. Now we will solve both the equations. Okay x is equal to minus b minus 5 plus minus square root b square so 5 is square 25 minus 4 a c a is 1 c is 8 4 times 8 32 over 2 a a is 1 so minus 5 plus minus i will get 25 minus 32 negative 7 so our solution is about to come which is square root of negative 1 is i. So I will take i outside. It will remain with root 7. So there are two complex solutions. You can see minus 5 plus minus i times root 7 over 2. Now we will find out second equation solution. I will write x is equal to minus b minus 5 plus minus a square root b square so 25 minus 4ac so 8 over 2a so 2. Now negative 5 plus minus 25 minus 8 17 over 2. So here we are having four solutions of our quartic equation. Two solutions are real and two are imaginary. So real solution and here we are having imaginary solutions. Okay. This is how we will solve using you can say algebraic trick. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share. Thanks for your support.